Logan was violent. He has a temper. So do I. It's not a crime. We have testimony from independent sources. Kate Howard, Dr. Matt Hunter, on the last days of Logan's life, that he was combative, that he was delusional for Lulu, that he showed up at her workplace insisting they get back together. The ambulance called five minutes ago. They'll be arriving in the ER any second. All right, well, go ahead and look in the OR, because the patient needs surgery. May needs surgery. We monitor him for at least 24 hours. Do you, do you have a date that you have to go on? Because I'm sure that's fine. I'll just find another neurosurgeon who'll be willing to supervise when I operate. Don't slice a guy's head open for the hell of it. OK, I'll see one of you downstairs. So does anyone question the judgment of the mighty Dr. Drake? Or, re really, am I the first? Knock yourself out, Slick. I already treated him for migraines the first time he was in here. What I say goes, and I say we wait. And you're late for rounds. Dr. Henry, call 2557. Dr. Tyler Henry, call 2557. Patrick, did you pay me? No, it must have been Robin. They're talking about Eli Love, and Anna looks pretty annoyed. Well, she should be. She's much too good for that long life. The patient is resting comfortably in his room. You might want to look at his chart. Swelling is down. No need for that OR. If this is your way of rubbing it in that Dr. Drake's diagnosis was correct, I, I, I'm good, actually, because I've got the reminder right here. You know, you might want to work with the members of this staff instead of against them, because some of us have bandaging heads while you were still skinning Dr. your knees. Lee, call 5981. Dr. Kelly Lee, Excuse call me. Mm -hmm. Um, I had a page from Dr. Drake Sr. Hey, thanks for coming. Oh, hello. So, um, before you start, I imagine that this is the pep talk about me going with Ron and Patrick to Eli's concert, no? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Okay. No, that before you start this whole speech, I'd like you to know that I would prefer a dinner invitation from you than all of this other stuff. We have been so busy reacting to our impending grandparenthood that we haven't actually had a chance to catch up as friends. I, I would absolutely love to. Good. But I don't want you to use me to hide from me, I love. Mm -hmm. 